Your eye health is my top priority. I am dedicated to providing you the personalized care you deserve using the latest and most innovative techniques in eye surgery. I offer a variety of laser and other refractive procedures, including all laser LASIK and other treatments to help restore and maintain your optimal vision health. Careful assessments of all patients seeking refractive surgery is vital to make sure that there are no contraindications to the treatment, such as thin cornea or dry eye. At the Nuffield Health Plymouth, I have at my disposal all the necessary up-to-date computerized scanners and computer-guided topography analyzers to make sure that the treatment plan is personalized to each patient. LASIK is the most commonly performed and well-known vision correction surgery. The typical patient will have either short sight, long sight, or astigmatism and wants to decrease or eliminate dependence on glasses or contact lenses. Using an excimer laser, the cornea, which is the clear window at the front of the eye, is reshaped so that images are properly focused on the retina. Although no operation is without risks, the success rate with this procedure is excellent with most patients achieving 20-20 vision or better upon completion. During the procedure, local anesthetic eye drops are administered, so the patient will feel no pain during the surgery. A speculum is then placed over the eye to prevent the patient from blinking. Next, a flap from the outer layer of the cornea is usually made using femtosecond laser without a blade to perform the first stage of the LASIK procedure. The femtosecond laser works to very precise and reproducible parameters and this level of precision enables the creation of extremely thin flaps, also known as subbomans keratomeleuses, which has been demonstrated to produce improved outcomes and has been approved for use in US fighter pilots and NASA astronauts. The flap is folded to the side and the excimer laser programmed with individual personalized map of the patient's eye, including wavefront guided treatment and iris registration, removes excess tissue with quick pulses of concentrated light. This process usually takes less than a minute. Once this is done, the flap is folded back into place and surgery is complete. The LASIK procedure itself involves little discomfort both during the treatment and through the recovery process. Eyesight improvement is usually quick and maximum vision is typically achieved within a few days or weeks. I'm a very active and busy person with three children and a demanding full-time job. I couldn't wait to be rid of my glasses and contact lenses. Even though I was nervous before the procedure, Mr. Habib and his team made me feel comfortable and confident. I knew I was in safe hands. The care and attention I received at the Nuffield Hospital was wonderful. Everybody was friendly yet professional. Everything went like clockwork and within a couple of hours I went home. I felt no pain, my sight had instantly improved and within a week I was back at work without my glasses. Since then, my sight has simply got better and better. Every day I wake up and think it truly is a miracle. I'm delighted and thrilled with the results. My only regret is that I didn't see Mr. Habib sooner. I'd worn glasses and contact lenses for many years and latterly I'd had to move to bifocals. That for me was really the last straw. I suppose as anybody would, I had some concerns about the procedure, but after my initial assessment with Mr. Habib, those concerns were certainly uh, allayed. Day of the procedure, I was extremely well looked after by the Nuffield Hospital and all of its staff. The procedure itself was very comfortable, I would actually say painless, and my recovery time was really quite, quite rapid afterwards. Within a week, I was back at work, um, not needing either glasses or contact lenses, and my vision is now very clear and sharp. I've since had eye examinations which have assessed my vision at better than 20-20, so I would certainly recommend the procedure to anybody.